even as a coach, it's a special place when you you walk on that pitch and the players are up in front of the shed, and you know the Gloucester support is second to none. And uh, you know, for for me, they are the the fifteenth, sixteenth man all the time. They're they're extra. It spurs the players on hugely, and, and when they get you know behind the players, it's it's probably no better place to be in the Premiership. And I think that you know the the Gloucester fans are are special to Kingsholm, and, and they are what Kingsholm is. And you know. For us against any local derbies, Worcester, Bath, Bristol, wherever it may be, Exeter is, is pretty close. So they're there and they make a huge difference. So, you know, against that Bath game and Worcester, they're going to be, you know, vitally important. I think it's a huge asset to us and it's good pressure for us because they know that they're shouting and cheering the players on and you should enjoy that as a player. And the opposition and you drop the high balls or knock ons and warm ups, you're going to get you're going to get some chanting for them. So, uh, you know, it, it's a great place. and. and you know, we're very fortunate to have the shed. When someone mentions Gloucester or King's Home, oh, like straight away you think of the shed. Um, for the players, um, it's just, you know, I've I've been been at Gloucester for a number of years now and ev every year and every time I run around um, at the pitch at the start of the game, it just gets seems to get better and better. Um, they really, really want you to do well um, and they try and and you know, get behind you and, and through their voices. So, yeah, it's you know, it's the old adage: it's our 16th man. And when they're on, when they're on form, we definitely do play better. I do know, speaking around to friends at other clubs, that you know, that almost they do enjoy playing there because the atmosphere is that that good. Um, but yeah, I'm sure um, when a kit goes up and someone's drop it and they're all ear in and and getting stuck in, I'm sure it, it piles the pressure on. Being sort of you know from the outside, you know, coming into Gloucester, that that, that is a for me a Scotland England derby when that Bath Gloucester derby is huge and that is one that you know some people say if you win that game. Um, they're not fussed about some other games out throughout the season. That's the most important one, and you know some Bath people may have the same mindset, but that's that's what you want. That's why you play and you coach rugby. You love that that environment and that challenge. And uh, you know the Bath game is going to be special. And you know, as I said, we have Worcester prior to that as well, which is a derby game. So these games are brilliant for the club, and you know it'd be great to have sixteen and a half thousand people at Kingston. Fans are mic'd up to uh, heart rate monitors and stress rate monitors. Talk the director of rugby might be asked to do it. Think you might be interested in that? Oh, I don't know about that. I think uh, you know there's enough things to worry about than having a heart monitor on. And uh, you know I'll, I'll leave that to the fans. It'd be nice to see them and see their reactions. And you know for them as well, I guess they'll be a bit excited. But you know, there'll be a few uh, few hearts racing that day, I'm sure.